Hey everybody, I am Scott Stanton, and boy do I get emails. And lately they've all kind of sounded the same. Hey Scott, you know, you do a lot of uh, musicians, mob figures, you feature a lot of Hollywood actors and actresses. When are you going to do a philosopher? And if it's not too much to ask, how about a French philosopher? Well, if I got a treat for you today, Albert Camus. Now, Albert Camus was a French philosopher, and he was also an author, a journalist, political activist, and basically pontificator of great thoughts, deep thoughts. He won the Nobel Prize for Literature at a very young age, age 44, I believe. And some of his most popular works include The Strange, The Rebel, The Myth of Sisyphus, and The Fall. A couple of essential but absolutely useless facts about our friend Albert was that in his day he was incredibly handsome. He was married twice and had lots and lots of affairs. Schwing! But also the heavy metal band Avenged Sevenfold say that their album Life is But a Dream was based on the writings of Albert Camus. So feel free to drop those knowledge bombs at your next cocktail party and see how far that gets you. Okay, sadly, he died two years after his Nobel Prize at the age of 46 in an absolutely devastating car accident. Uh, the car was being driven by his publisher, um, and they were going down what's known as the, uh, I believe it's the, the RN6 highway, just outside Ville Bleven. And they hit two trees, uh, and the second one stopped the car dead, and Albert died immediately. The driver, uh, he passed away, I believe, five days later. Uh, and the driver, and again, his uh, publisher, his wife and his daughter were in the back seat, and they survived, and they later, later said that it was really, he had been drinking too much, and too much speed. So once again, alcohol and speed kills. He is buried in Cemetery du Lormarin in Provence, France. And that's where he lived in his final years. That little township, by the way, Lormarin, you need to visit it. If you're in France, it is a quintessential French village. You'll love it. Trust me on that. Um, now, today's video is from Friend of the Tombstone Tourist, Mo Carrar. And uh, it's going to get you right to the grave. But should you require GPS and other instructions, along with all the great photos and videos I have and articles about the late great philosopher, please visit me at thetombstonetourist.com. And rather than tell you how to get to the grave, I'm just going to show you. Have a great day.